Yeah, it's been pretty tough. Um, and I think the ship's not really set up for it to have people on board long term. You know, the idea is to you, you make a rescue and then maybe three days, maybe four, at a push five days. If you're doing multiple rescues, you might be in the SAR zone. But normally after three days, they've got a port and you say goodbye. Um, so a lot of, yeah, a lot of strange, um, strange problems like just getting people to eat the same thing for nearly two weeks, rice and beans every day, twice a day, you know, um, no new news, just giving them the same thing every morning saying, yeah, we, we still don't know. Um, yeah, it's a bit tough. It actually, it's really tough. We had um, good times and really hard times together with our guests. The good times, uh, for example, was Christmas when we had a when we had a nice party on the aft deck, celebrating together um, with them. And uh, we had hard times when there was storm, when there was heavy wind and high waves, and when everybody was afraid and unsecure and unsafe. very bad situation. We have been in this place on top of this ship now over let's say two weeks. No sleeping because of the wave. You know, cold, much cold, people are sick. It's not easy. It's not easy. It's not easy at all. So No, in Libya it's not easy. There are many things happening there, a lot of things. Before you even cross Libya, it's very hard. Because there are different things happening. Selling people. Yeah, yeah, buying and selling, just imagine buying and selling human being in Libya. So, to pass Libya is not easy. Because, because imagine when I'm coming, if I get to Saba, I was, I was arrested by some of Libyan mafias, it took me to some of prisons. Okay, we're a, I'm aboard this ship and it's a very depressing situation. I have talked to the uh, guests here, the, the, the migrants who were lost at sea, and I think it's very urgent, very important that there is a solution for the situation here right now and for the other boat, for the CI uh, ship as well, with uh, this rather small number of, of refugees and it has to be a, a, Europe, a solution quickly that they can go on land because their situation is really bad and it's getting worse.